Pakistan's former Prime Minister, Imran Khan, said on Thursday, May 30 February's national election was stolen from his party, describing it as the biggest robbery of a public mandate. Khan, speaking in the Supreme Court via video link from Adila Jail in the garrison city of Rawalpindi, said he was being held in solitary confinement. His remarks were the first to be heard in open court since he was jailed in August. My party is being victimized. There have been gross human rights violations, Khan said. The February 8 election was the biggest robbery of a public mandate. The Election Commission has denied the election was rigged. Khan, a 71-year-old cricketer politician, was jailed on corruption charges. He is also fighting dozens of other cases. He and his Pakistan Terry Insaf Party PTI say the charges were politically motivated to thwart his return to power. Candidates backed by Khan won the most seats in February's election but fell short of a majority required to form a government. His opponent Shabazz Sharif became prime minister in a coalition government with several other parties. Khan was allowed by the top court to appear and plead petitions he had filed against amendments in the country's anti-graft laws, which he claims was made to favor corrupt politicians. The court, however, turned down his request to leave stream the proceedings. It said it was not a public interest case, according to a Reuters reporter inside the courtroom. Khan has previously been speaking to a select group of reporters who are allowed to cover his closed-door trials conducted inside the jail. His aides have been conveying his messages after visiting him and his social media accounts remain active, but it is unclear who is operating them. He has faced numerous cases since his ouster in 2022 in a parliamentary vote of confidence, which he alleged was backed by the powerful military after he had fallen out with the army generals. The army denies the accusations.